Our top story tonight, a controversial push at the Capitol to ban transgender athletes from competing in women's sports. Good evening, I'm Natalie Shepard. And I'm Mike Stralo, and for Jessup Reisbeck, the bill supported by Republicans was met with immediate pushback. CBS 58 Capitol correspondent Emily Fannin is live in Madison with more on the proposal. Emily. Earlier today, about a dozen protesters showed up outside the state capitol in opposition of this bill to bar transgender athletes. LBGT community groups called it an attack on the transgender community. Why would you compete if you knew you couldn't win? That's the argument from a group of Republican lawmakers who believe the state should create a fair playing field in women's sports. You can't win against men, and that's the, bio the biology, the reality. And honestly, you'll ruin women's sports forever. The Protecting Women in Sports Act would ban transgender athletes from competing in female sports. The legislation sparked a protest from LGBTQ groups and Democratic lawmakers outside the Capitol in opposition of the bill. A parent of a transgender teen called the proposal personal. You know, a visible show of, you know, opposition to the people in the building who think that this should be their priority. This is yet another attack um, on transgender youth, uh, an attempt to tell them that they're not welcome. The push to prevent transgender athletes from participating in K-12 through and college-level sports is likely to face a veto from Governor Evers. Shortly after the bill was introduced, Governor Evers expressed his support for the transgender community in a tweet, I see you, you are welcome, you are wanted, and you belong. About 17 other states are proposing restrictions on transgender athletes. Reporting live in Madison, Emily Fannin, CBS 58 News.